Alright, here is a another cool diamond crystal. And look at this thing, man. It is... It's got some really interesting terminations. You see that? It makes kind of a, a hollow crystal in there. And you can see the um, the three axes right here in the striations of that. That's not broken. That's part of the crystal growth faces, right? And the crystal grew along all of these. It didn't start out little, like short on this side and grow up. It started out looking just like this and grew from the inside out. And these look exactly like the clear crystals I have on my on some of my rocks from my mine near Safford, Arizona. They form kind of a, a wedge-shaped uh, termination. But my first opal mine has what I called fancy quartz crystals. And they are hollow. They form in geodes, they form in things that look like chalcedony, and they make these darn little hollow crystals. And I had never seen anything like that before, and I pretty much just ignored them. And they didn't uh, mean anything to me. I thought they were quartz. And you know, when, when you know what something is, you don't investigate any further, right? You already know what it is. And that's what happened. I ignored them. And now I know... <laughs> that they're not, in fact, quartz at all. It is... a diamond. <laughs> 